fuck out of here! Hey, demo man, how are you doing? What is that green whiskey you're drinking? Oh, I'm drinking grown fiat since to draw on the terrifying fetishes that scouts smuggled from the entire team. I'm so traumatized that I can't sleep at night anymore. So, can I have some grown fear absent? Maybe we should talk about the other fetishes Scout kept secret from us. Kinda like therapy to get shit off your chest. Ah, okay, I suppose that alcohol isn't the answer to the shit haunting me every day and night. Alright, much better. Now it's creeping in your head! Oh, where the hell should I start? Well, Miss Pauline told us Scout's fetishes, so we'll cut those out of your list. So what else have you discovered while well, nobody was looking? Okay, I just found uh, that Scout. Unsurprisingly, it's very comics on his folder. There was so much rape and gay shit in those comics, I wanted to fucking puke myself to death. And it was wide open. Next, I found disgusting pictures of giant lion furries licking and fucking smaller cat furries at the same time, even eating them with their fucking dicks. It made my eye bleed to fucking death. Then I found out Scout liked to watch furries raping corpses of little girls. There was so fucking much rotting flesh and guts that they gutted themselves at the end of the disgusting to our video. I'm more than happy to be drinking the Irish whiskey. What's next? Fetish monsters! Well, what gave that away? Scout! Just fucking Scout! Anyhow, Scout did a picture of a six eyed ten tenth little slug woman raping multiple teenage girls and swallowing them whole and alive at once. Plus, she also dug up graves and ate corpses of little kids. And then there were these black frog women with chartreuse glowing bellies raping women, pumping his loads of eggs in them before the tadpoles burst out of their victim's gut, even butchered men alive. Chartreuse! Chartreuse is green and yellow combined. Okay, carry on. I... Uh, I found pictures of cockroach men fucking rotting corpses buried in the ground and eating the rotting guts out. I just wanted to fucking puke 24-7. While Soldier and I were cleaning out Scout's room, we found that Scout had comics of Grigory impregnating Vanessa before she swallows him alive. They were both naked, and the furries were watching it. Then we found Scout's collection of monster girls under his bed, jars of jizz and piss, toys in piss jars. And we found fucking disgusting used diapers and dresses for women. I puked my guts inside out. Monster girls! Shall I describe them? If we're talking about Scout, then yes. Get that shit off your chest. Okay, Scout had pictures of that six on tail snake women eating orphans and saying they're home inside her snake belly. Green glowing electric mermaids fucking eating the guts out of little girls. Cat furries playing in each other's shit. Crocking mermaids raping children and teenagers before swallowing them all. Yellow snail girls raping little boy scouts. Smell women raping and eating naked men. She male furries impregnating their own kids and parents. She male furries swallowing each other with their own dicks. Fat snake octopus women with dicks. Fat blackish blue frog women eating fairies. So much fucking etc. in my list of shit to complain about. I'm so fucking sick of discovering scouts too many fetishes. I'm so glad Spy killed Scout last week. But still. All of the shit Scout is creeping into still haunts me every day and night. Scout's anime, Scout's incest, Scout's my little pony porn, Scout's furry porn. Scout's your limit monster porn. I was so traumatized to see how many fucking fetishes Scout hid beneath his fucking bed. How the fuck does he get away with the majority of his fetishes? Why does he fucking exist? Why? Just fucking okay, why? Okay, stop right there. I heard enough. Maybe we should talk about this over dinner with the rest of the team. Pyra's cooking a variety of chimichangas. I bet he put guacamole in the chimichangas. All right, you think they can help me out with scat shit? Of course they can. They... Wait, what the hell is going on? Why are there green fairies everywhere? I don't know. I've been seeing these green fairies before you came over. I highly doubt that the absinthe is what's making me hallucinate green fairies. There's something else in the green whiskey. Well, it says the ingredients are wormwood fennel, hyssopine, and a star anise, mint sugar, and marijuana and green glowing mushrooms. This isn't normal absinthe. Where did you get this kind of Irish absinthe? 
Because real ground fear absence shouldn't make hallucinations like this. Listen, I understand that it's all Chinese, but we have Google Translate nowadays. And speaking of Chinese, did you get this Chinese accent from some wandering Chinese guy trying to get the dollar? I'm pretty sure that weird Chinese saleswoman, um, I think she added any other ingredients without telling me. And how do you know how to read traditional Chinese? Truth be told, my mother is Russian, obviously, but my father, on the other hand, is Chinese. And while I was with my father in China, he taught me how to speak Chinese making me a Chinese-Russian son. So anyways, where were we? Okay, I remember. She already told you what the ingredients were in the ingredients label. Why the hell do I have to read the boring shit? Because they tell you what the ingredients are. Why do you care about the ingredients? Because this acid contains marijuana and green glow mushrooms. They both combine cause twice as much hallucinations. Well, excuse me for not giving a fuck about the ingredients you put in the absinthe. I don't see the point in reading the bullshit there right on the back of the bag of chips. Oh, really? Then how do you know you didn't mistakenly drink any sperm hidden in the liquors you already drank? On the snacks you already ate? <laughs>